blur here and I have a little game tutorial really short though but it's gonna be, um, be how to add your little uh, what's it called uh, watermark on your videos so as you can see I'm uploading this video right here and it has blur in the corner um, I'm gonna be teaching you how to make that so first open up GIMP and the TV is kinda loud so I'm gonna go turn it down and I'll be right back okay um so I'm back and once you have GIMP open um, you are going to uh, go to file go to create go to your logos and then choose any of these you want I'll do three of them to see so I'll just type in blur uh, do whatever font you want I don't care and then press OK and then it generates so there's the chalk and yeah so now um, if you don't like that one then just uh, close it and then reopen and note another one and you could do let's say glossy blur so you can do you can look through all of this I really don't care what you do but as long as you like it that's all that matters to me so I'll do a die dot or whatever and then let's generate that so that looks pretty cool um I'm gonna stick to the one I have right now so if I'll create logos and I have frosty so blur you can have the default text for it and there you go you have your uh, thing so as you can see I'm uploading this video or it's uploaded and that's uh, that font I used right there I have this one right here too so let's say you like this one um make sure uh, if you're gonna use it in your videos I'm sure you had to do that or uh, add it to your videos too see if your watermark um you need to do this or else it'll look like uh, really crappy um, go over here to your layers and delete the background just delete it then go to file save as name it whatever so I'm gonna do blur uh, logo 2 go to select file type by extension go down until you see PNG and save it export and then save and boom then you can close it and uh, get the video that you want so I'll just use this one since it's already up and find your logo so blur logo 2 and drag it to your desktop if you want you don't have to and simply just drag it right above your screen recording then put it all the way to the end make it all the way to the end of the video if you want and put it right there in the corner or wherever you can put it in the middle dead center in, the, in this corner in this corner or in this corner or wherever you want I like it in this little corner and there you go just upload the video and it should be right there um now if you use iMovie to edit your films and stuff um I'll show you how to do that real quick I don't use Sony Vegas or anything I don't think I can open that on a Mac but whatever so I have my little session glitch that's kind of loud sorry and uh, what you're gonna do is go to uh, click iMovie go to prefer preferences and then click show advanced tools make sure you have that or else it will not work so um, yeah drag your logo thing um, onto it 
onto it, sorry. Not. One sec. Um. I kind of forgot. <laughs> um. Hmm. That's weird. I thought you just like drop it on. Oh, yep. You drop it on, and then you press picture in picture, and then it should go right above it. Extend it all the way to the beginning, all the way to the end, and uh, just drag it to where you want it. So, any corner, make it smaller, add it to the corner. I'll put it in this corner so you don't like uh, miss the rounds or anything. And so you could start it from the beginning, see if you like it. And you could see the little watermark. So that's my little tutorial for you guys today. And I hope you enjoyed it. Not much people know how to do this, so yeah. Give me a thumbs up and a comment. And also a sub. Takes one little click, doesn't hurt. Thank you.